In the year of our Lord, 1349, a violent pestilence broke out beyond measure in the whole of the Kingdom of England. Many were compelled to bury their dead in places unseemly, not hallowed or blessed. Some, it was said, cast the corpses into the river. 1349 was the year Britain died. The year of the Black Death. It is the most lethal catastrophe in recorded human history. Now Europe's biggest engineering project has brought the victims back from the grave. It's a unique opportunity to solve the greatest mysteries of the Black Death. No one knows how many were killed. No one knows exactly what killed them. No one knows how society survived. But the dead have returned with a warning. Plague has what it takes. Plague can do it again. It's a message we can't afford to ignore. Horton Down in Wiltshire is Britain's front line of defence against biological attack. Behind these walls, a dangerous killer is kept in maximum security. Its name is Yersinia pestis, otherwise known as bubonic plague. And for Tim Brooks, it's a clear and present danger to national security. We maintain a constant watch on what is going on. Whenever something happens that's unusual, the appearance of a new disease, then we think about how that's going to affect the UK. Bubonic plague still thrives on four continents. But right now, the greatest threat is on the African island of Madagascar. Rats and their fleas are spreading plague to the human population. In the last year, 60 people have died. Madagascar is only a few hours by aeroplane, and 